Hello, welcome to Rome Review. My name is Thomas. We're going to talk about Paco Rabanne Phantom. So I've given this quite a few wearings now because when I first put it on, uh, I've had it for a couple of weeks. When I first put it on, I kind of just went, oh man, oh, again, again, like a, you know, your, your usual sweet designer kind of um, fragrance. Uh, it kind of, I thought, oh, is it another scandal? Because scandal, I just didn't like scandal very much. Like, it smells like sweet plastic kids' toys. Not not a big fan of it. So anyway, so when I put, first put this on, I thought, oh, here we go again, here we go again. But you know what? After, after a few wearings, I'm kind of like, kind of going, ah, do you know what it is? It isn't bad, like, it's not bad. It's, uh, I'll read the notes out anyway and uh, give you a kind of a breakdown. And it, it, one of the designers for this, one of the perfumers, was Dominic Ropion, which is a uh, he's a good good designer. Uh, so the top notes are lavender, lemon zest, and lemon. Middle notes lavender, apple, earthy notes, patchouli, and smoke. And the base notes are vanilla and lavender. So this kind of it does a little mill here, and uh, there's. People are talking about the similarities to Ultra Male, and I kind of get that. But for uh, for what it's worth, I think it's actually better than Ultra Male. Uh, Ultra Male on my skin kind of doesn't work. There's something in it. I think it's like the mixture of vanilla and uh, and lavender and cinnamon in it, and the amber as well. Which kind of turns Ultra Male starts off for me quite actually quite nice, it actually quite bright and, uh, and a little bit. It's got this like tiny little bit of fruit in it, and it's actually quite. When I first put it on my skin, it's actually all right, but as it as it settles down on my skin, it becomes this kind of ambery. Uh, anyway, it doesn't it doesn't work on my skin, so I'm just not a I'm not a big fan of Ultra Male. This. The the Phantom, the robot. I don't know where they get the the, the robot stuff from, but where, 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 it's obviously they've got to think. So I, I literally, I've been trying to rack my brains on what the what the the robot uh, encapsula encapsulates, and I, I'm just like no, no idea. So uh, so Phantom, like it says, it's got the same. It's kind of the same as Ultra Meal. I can say that in its in its DNA and its makeup and how it actually overall smells. But it doesn't become on my skin, it works much better than what Ultra Meal does. So it doesn't become that kind of ambery it, like a I don't know, on my it's just on my skin. Uh, I have smelled it uh like on paper and stuff like that. And it uh it just doesn't it doesn't work for me but this is actually all right so i started off like i says i'll get back to the beginning again i started off going ah oh, again ah oh, it's just this it's just oh, oh, it was like that but then like i says i thought you know what it is i'll give it I, yeah, smell it it smells all right it doesn't it it develops quite nicely on my skin and it it's actually got pretty good performance as well so it's it's not it is nice. It's actually quite good, uh, and it's probably something I would buy a bottle of uh, if I was wanting something kind of summery. Uh, I would say summery, springy, autumny, maybe even wintry. It's quite versatile, and I think it's 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 versatile in the way that you can probably use it. Uh, I, I personally, I would use it for. Daytime and nighttime. It's kind of that kind of scent with it, with that kind of versatility. Maybe that's what the robot is, or robots versatile. I don't know. Uh, so yeah, it's it's pretty good. It's 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 a nicely done fragrance. Uh, when I when like I says, when I did spray it on, I was like, oh, the same again, because of the way it's made. It's it isn't unique. Uh, by any stretch of the imagination, uh, yeah, I, I don't think anyway. I mean, uh, that's just my opinion at the end of the day. But uh, all in all, Phantoms, uh, it's actually quite decent. I actually quite like it. 
it has it's been totally destroyed on fragrant again i think the overall score is a 3.1 240 volts so it's you know it's getting looks like it's getting a lot of hate from the community but uh, people are saying it's like one million lucky lucky is the same as ultra male on me it just it, it doesn't work well on my skin so what 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 i'm kind of saying is overall if ultra male is goes doesn't work on your skin then this is a good alternative because it's not um, it's not ambery it hasn't got that ambery uh it hasn't got that ambery base where it becomes that mm, that fuzz for me uh so the base of it is nice a nice light vanilla uh lavender and a nice light vetiver as well so it's it's good it's pretty good get yourself a tester i think i think uh i think pack or are giving testers out i think if you sign up for the a subscription on the website or something uh have a look uh and get yourself a little to do a little oh i'll give my i've, I've given the other one the other little one away like but uh, that's fine all right thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one